What's up everybody, Marcus here. Today, when I woke up, I was thinking to myself, what if there are people who don't have such a strong PC that they got low specs, for example, they are working on a not that great notebook and they would like to edit videos, but every program they edit it, it's lacking and they can't render great and it's not that. So I decided I'm going to show you what is the best performance video editor you can have right now in the 2019 and I'm going to compare it with different video editors so we can see it to yourself. The editor is called Olive and I'm going to put a lot of footage there and you will see the beauty of it. So first I create a plenty of tutorials. You will find it on my channel, how to edit in Olive, what to do on Olive. It's completely for free. You don't have any watermarks there. And I recommend it so much because the people who developed this program are just awesome. So I got it here right now. This is the footage. I'm going to lower the volume of it. And as you could see, it's not lagging at all, but that's not all. Let's say that I'm going to put out more footage into it. Many times, if you would have like plenty of footage, it would start logging. And if you would have, for example, okay, I got footage here from Starcraft. Now I'm going to put a skewer here. So I'm putting my footage of Starcraft right into this corner and then here into this corner. And we will see if it's lagging or no. So I'm going to close also Google. I'm going to also close my Opera. So my hardware is not that used. And this is what I recommend. Don't have ever opened a Google Chrome, Opera, or Firefox or whatsoever because your program will be lagging. So, so right now we are going to see, I got a Starcraft here. While the, it's all free videos playing at the same time. While the quality of the video it's really amazing, the preview video. And it's awesome. And right now I'm going to show you DaVinci Resolve 15 or even 16 now. And we are going to compare it. So it's still going clean. And this is why I love this so much. Three videos at the same time while I'm recording the whole process. And now let's stop it. And I'm going to put the, all the same footage in Da Vinci. So I changed the position of my uh, video also from Starcraft and also from another Sekiro footage. And we got a Sekiro footage behind it. It's the same as in Olive. Uh, also the project settings, the project dimensions are the same. So it's no difference. And let's see, I need to Wait a second, I will just move my audio down and let's see if it's lagging or no. And I mean, you can see it clearly. And even if I would have just one footage, it would lag. So for example, DaVinci is really hardcore for video preview and plenty of people are saying that it's really hard to work with the DaVinci. Yes, DaVinci is great for some things, but from the editing perspective, it's not that great. And now it's lagging again. And if you would like to edit, the more edits you would do here, the more lags you would have. And let's say, for example, I want to show you something. I'm going to delete this one and this one, and I'm going to add effects library. I will get just the titles, for example, this thing. And now again, I have lag. Sometimes it happens. So for example, if I just add a normal fusion title, you see it's lagging. And this is what I don't like about DaVinci. And sometimes it's really hard to work in it. Yep. So, and let's, for example, try Olive. And even if I would edit it and give the the graphic design, it will be all fine and you don't see any lags. So this is about it. This is why I think Olive is the best right now video editor uh, performance wise.
for the basic editing and how we can edit it and how we can be better as a video editor. Also, if you have low specs, just go for it. You will have a link in the description where you can download Olive. It's completely for free. And that's about it. And this is why I'm only comparing free programs. I don't compare programs like Sony Vegas or Premiere because they are paid. You need to pay for them. And also, I don't uh, talk about Filmora because it got watermark and you need to pay it for it also. If you enjoyed this video, I would be pretty happy if you supported me with subscribe, but definitely write in the comments if you agree with me or if you are working with different program, which is better performance wise than Olive. And that's about it. Thank you all. I hope you are going to have a great day and see ya.